Honestly, I, I do think there's doping in swimming. I didn't single out a single country or a single person. So, so for it to have been reported that way, it's, it's a little bit disappointing. Uh, but my message has, has been really consistent. I think there's doping in the sport. I want to be part of this solution. He just like is dominating now. I think there's there's been doping in, in every country and, and that's really part of the reason why I said what I said as a general statement. I, I don't think I don't think Russia's the only the only country at fault here. Um, I, I think it's it's a lot larger of an issue than that. And I think at the end of the day what we really are pushing for, especially in Olympic sports, is we want transparency and consistency across all of the countries. And I, I do strongly believe in incentives. Uh, I don't think that currently people are afraid of the consequences to, to dope. I don't think the consequences are strong enough. Um, and so I, I don't necessarily know what, what incentives go far enough to, to make people scared of it. I think it was, it's definitely a concern uh, about the lack of testing as a result of COVID. I think the number was that testing was down 45% in, in the year 2020. Honestly, the only way this sport grows is if we eradicate doping in the sport. People have to be able to trust the results that they're seeing in order to want to watch the sport.